Welcome back. How's everyone today? Black coffee. St. David of Pipes coffee mug. Olive wood pipe. And uh, class, what am I smoking in it? You have one or two choices. Correct, it's Sir Walter Raleigh. When that tin's done, we'll go to velvet. What I'd go down memory lane today and talk about ashtrays. Who remembers the countless, countless ashtrays from days of yore? I like that word, yore, days of yore. First of all, Every car and every pickup truck and every semi-truck, everything that had wheels, I wouldn't even be surprised if motorcycles had ashtrays. That's a joke. That's a joke. Uh, I had a 72 Caprice, Chevy Caprice, when I was in high school. My dad wouldn't let me buy any muscle cars, what he called trouble cars. So I paid for the car myself, but... I had to get a big boat car. His rule, my money. Anyway, it's not about cars, it's about ashtrays. The ashtray in the front, under the radio, was so big, you could have bathed a baby in it. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, they actually called it a cigar tray in the brochure. I remember reading the old, it was a used car, mind you. It was like eight, nine years old when I bought it. But still had the car brochure, and they called it a cigar tray. It was enormous. Then the back seat had ashtrays on the on the sides. Uh, you know, the elbow rests on the sides. There was one in the middle you could fold down. Then how about all the ashtrays in the houses? You had... Uh, those stand ashtrays, you know, yay big, uh, on like a stand, big heavy glass, you know, near the easy chair or somewhere. And uh, you had crystal ashtrays. You had all kind of uh, novelty ashtrays, you know, made out of a, a baseball or, you know, you know where I'm going at. Just amazing. Then how about all the cheapy ashtrays? You know, you would... You would go to the five and dime. I bet you haven't heard that word in a while. Buy the 30 cent beanbag ashtray. And uh, then, of course, the ashtrays uh, stamped out of uh, aluminum or whatever it was at McDonald's or Burger King. And then, of course, the hotel ashtrays. How many homes have you been in that had a Holiday Inn ashtray or a Marriott ashtray? <laughs> oh, that's good stuff. And my parents did not smoke. My dad uh, started cigarette smoking in Wales when he was like 13, but he quit when he was like 30 over here in the United States. And uh, they kept ashtrays uh, for the relatives. Just amazing. They didn't even smoke and they had ashtrays in the house. Uh, they would keep them in the drawers when no company or was, was there, but when, when company came, uh, they would get the ashtrays out. I remember my grandmother had this enormous ashtray. Uh, it was like a burgundy color. It was like, yay, thick. It was, I mean, if you'd hit someone over the head, you, you'd be you'd be on an episode of Perry Mason. That's a joke. Uh, here's what I use. You're going to laugh. I use an old Pirates, Pittsburgh Pirates coffee mug. Okay. And, uh, that's what I use to knock my pipe out, my pipe ashes. So, uh, ashtrays. Yeah, memory lane. Something different on uh, St. David's Pipe channel. Ashtrays. We'll see you. Have a great day.